Hi there, this is Roderick from Toy Masters Video Magazine. I'm still here at Comic Con 2010 at Jacob Jarrett's Convention Center in New York City. We're here with Mr. Clayton Moore of the CS Moore Studio. It's my company. We produce statues and busts, bronzes for the comic collectible statue market. And we're going to talk about some of our new products. Uh, I have a few of the pieces that we have in stock. You can go to csmorestudio.com to see uh, our pieces that we have and also news about upcoming pieces. And why don't we start with, this is a variant of a piece that I did. This is Alice in Wonderland. I'm talking to the little hooker smoking caterpillar. This is with Xenoscope, Comics, and Fantastic Realm. It's a limited edition. We haven't set the edition size, but it will be limited and they'll have a certificate of authenticity as well. And the first piece, Cali, was very popular and sold out, and we have great expectations for this piece also. Another piece that's brand new is my first winged piece. This is a character called Angelus from Top Cow Comics. She's kind of an angel demon woman, a warrior. And this is the regular edition. We're also doing an emerald edition, which is now sold out. And here you see the wings. It's about, what, about 22, 24 inches tall. And this will be a limited edition, of course, uh, produced in cold cast porcelain. And then you have Lady Death, which is a piece that uh, we released about a year ago. Another piece we have with Joe Lindsner is my first Dawn sculpture. This is for the 20th anniversary of Dawn, so we did it in royal purple, kind of a uh, celebratory color for the piece. And she has a lot of the symbols of the character, like the roses and the uh, ram symbol and her boots, things like that. And it's a great character. Joe did her, uh, started the, the character about 20 years ago, so we're doing the anniversary. And that's a piece that you can learn more about on our website also. And we have some of our pieces like Witchblade and She Dragon. We've been having great success with the faux bronze line. Now this is a faux bronze, it's actually a resin piece. For those collectors that can't necessarily afford a bronze, they can have a nice bronze look for about a tenth of the price. And these have all sold out because they're only editions of 250, so it's very rare for that discerning collector. And this is the Aphrodite 9. The Witchblade is our latest piece, the classic Witchblade. We also have Kabuki and the Conan the Conqueror with the great Frank Rosetta, of course. Unfortunately, we lost him a few months ago, but it's the great grandmaster of fantasy art. Again, if you go to csmorestudio.com, you can see in progress, you can see news about upcoming pieces, what's on the horizon, what's in stock, and anything you might want to know. You can also contact us and we'll answer any question you might have. Thank you for all that information and showing off some of the new products that you have coming out. My pleasure. Thanks for tuning in. All right. It's Roderick from Toy Masters Video Magazine. Hi there, it's Roderick. We're back here again with uh, Mr. Moore. Just wanted to talk about one more thing that we just happened to miss. Right. I wanted to work with J. Scott Campbell for years and years and years. He's one of my favorite artists. And he's done some pieces for Xenoscope. And we're doing a series with Xenoscope, a series with Top Cow. But a piece I'm working on right now, let's see if we can see that, is this piece right here of Snow White from Xenoscope Comics. And I've already started the piece. Pretty soon we'll start rolling out in progress photos on the website. So if you're a fan of mine, a fan of statues, and a fan of J. Scott Campbell, come to our site and take a look and we'll show you how it's going. Thanks.